And now let's take a look at the top stories from the world of showbiz. Parasite director Bong Joon-ho and other veteran members of South Korea's entertainment industry urged authorities to thoroughly investigate the case of actor Lee Sun Kyo, who was found dead amid a drug probe. The 48-year-old actor, who played a wealthy patriarch in the Oscar-winning film Parasite, died in December under mysterious circumstances, and his death brought an outpouring of sympathy from the film industry and the public alike. It also raised questions over the harsh and public nature of the probe that fueled media coverage into Lee's private life. The holdovers and killers of the flower moon earned multiple laurels at the National Board of Review Awards in New York and while filmmaker Martin Scorsese was named the best director for killers of the flower moon, his female lead Lily Gladstone was named the best actress. Actor Bradley Cooper earned the Icon Award for writing, directing and starring in Maestro, a film about composer Leonard Burstein. SAG-AFTRA has revealed the nominations for the 2024 Screen Actors Guild Awards. And Barbie and Oppenheimer lead the film nominees with four nominations each, while Killers of the Flower Moon received a three nods and The Color Purple and Maestro got two nominations each. HBO Succession led the TV categories with five nominations and The Bear, The Last of Us and Ted Lasso all earned four nods. The ceremony is all set to take place in Los Angeles on February 24th.